PSA just graded my stainless steel Dark Magician Girl. Let's see what happened. PSA return. I graded a bunch of really cool cards, including, of course, the stainless steel Dark Magician Girl, an actual stainless steel card. And I'm really curious to know if they actually graded it. And if they did, what grade did it get? Uh, let's find out, guys. I wish me luck because it is a mystery. I don't know anything, any of the grades. So, what? Let's see. Let's go. You know what? Let's do this one first. Okay's Pokemon. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, this is such a cool one. 2024 Pokemon Tiff EN. I don't know what it is. PSA 10. So, guys, really quickly, I want to give a big thank you to my boy Gonzo. Gonzo is the one that sent all this uh, to PSA. I didn't do anything, man. So, he did all the work. Uh, he does have like a membership for uh, for PSA where he pays, I believe, like $100 a year. And you get like a discounted uh, uh, if you send like uh, some slabs. So we pay, we end up paying like $14 per uh, uh, slab. So I think it's kind of cheap. So yeah, big thank you to uh, Gonzo. He does have his own YouTube channel where he opens Pokemon. So if you're interested, go check him out. I'll leave his video down in the description. So if it wasn't for Gonzo, I would never be, you know, grading cards, man. I do believe, guys, in my personal and in my humble opinion, grading cards, PSA or any grading card, it's actually a scam in my opinion guys uh i can tell you why so many reasons why but it's not you know i'm not gonna go through that uh it's cheap my boy gonzo did all the hard work thank you again man otherwise i would never be grading my cards uh i do love my cards are uh, raw rather but again cheaper why not you know so damn man so far starting with psa 10 let's hope we can you know keep that momentum right so you know what i'm gonna leave him right there second one here we go and it is another Pokemon card. To all on oh, oh same set, I believe. PSA 9 this time. Dang man. All these cards, by the way, guys, as far as we are concerned, they were in mint condition. Like he pulled all the cards uh, himself, by the way, guys. He's that type of guy, man. He's that type, he's my type of guy who would rather pull the car rather than you know just buy him, right? Another one. It's another okay. So I guess first is Pokemon and then that's Yu-Gi-Oh, I guess. And it is, oh, what a beauty, man. PSA 9, special illustration rare. This one looks, you know you know what, man? I have to admit, though, Pokemon has some really cool looking cards, man. Like this one, that looks amazing. PSA 9, PSA 9 unfortunately. Here we go, another one. Now, this might be like a um, shorter video. Uh, Pokemon, oh, same set. Okay, another PSA 9. Dang, man. Yeah, this is going to be a uh, rather uh, shorter video. Hope you guys enjoy. You know, I don't uh, do this kind of videos that often. So, and with that price, another PSA 9. What the heck? Bianca's Devotion. Same uh, set, I believe. That, yeah, this one looks pretty cool. Yeah, with this kind of price, it's 14 bucks, you know. And uh, my guy Gonzo, once again, big shout out to my guy. He's doing all the hard work. I might send more just for the content, you know. Another Pokemon. And it is. Another PSA 9, are you kidding me? Metagross? Metagross. I don't know anything about this set, guys. So uh, I will be uh, putting the prices, though. Uh, I do have a uh, an app that tells you the prices on all the PSA cards, regardless of the TCG. Hey, oh, th oh, this is this is mine. And this is a Dragon Ball, man. I actually pulled this card, man. And I didn't know at the time it was so expensive. And yeah, it's one of a kind. Look at this. And it is... PSA 10, let's go. Uh, the same uh, Malice. Malice to us in 2020. This car, when I first pulled it out of the booster box, was worth like $200 plus. It went down a little bit, but oh my goodness. So yeah, I'm a big fan, a big fan of Dragon Ball. So I'm like, why not? It's the only one that I have this pricey. And PSA 10, let's freaking go. And this guy looks amazing. And it is oh, a secret rare. Okay. Yeah, looks 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 awesome though. So yeah. So far, so good, man. Or oh, so far, decent, right? Another Pokemon. Here we go. Come on. Let's get another PSA 10. Come on. Oh, Pikachu. Oh, 10. Let's go. Lost Origin Pikachu B 2022 Pokemon, uh, whatever that is. Okay, this is cool. I like this one. Thunderbolt. Yeah. Again, man. Pokemon, you know. Oh, wait. 10 is over here. Some of the Pokemon artwork is really, really cool. I'm not going to lie. Another Pokemon. Here we go. Come on. It is PSA 9 Ghastly 2024. Uh, the illustration rare. Okay, PSA 9, man. Dang. Okay, this one's kind of cool. Look at that. It's got like a gold borders on the back. Okay, maybe a special. Ooh. 
Ultra Rare? PSA 10? Wait, is this Japanese? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, it is Japanese. Oh, nice. Nice. Okay, that one looks looks stunning, man. I didn't know, man. The OCG on Pokemon, it's actually better than the TCG, just like us. <laughs> just like Yu-Gi-Oh, right? Okay, this is the last Pokemon. This is the last Gonzos. Gonzos, hey, man, you got a few PSA 10s, man. That's awesome. Last one for Gonzo. Oh, another Ghastly. PSA 10. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Okay, one got a PSA 9 and one got a PSA 10. I don't get it, man. They look exactly the same, bro. That's crazy. Hey, you know what, man? Maybe you can keep the PSA 9 and just sell the PSA 10, maybe? Anyways, wait, there it is. <laughs> Why am I looking for it? Oh, man. Okay. Jeez. Okay, now, Yu-Gi-Oh type. Let's see. I'm really curious to know about the... Uh... Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's bring... Oh, ho, ho, Starlight Rare. <laughs> Uh, 2020 Magic Dragon Knights, ROTD, Starlight Rare, come on, man, please, PSA 10, I beg, <laughs> PSA 10, let's go, wow, jeez, man, look at that beauty, man, come on, you can't tell me that this is not more beautiful than the Pokemon, guys, come on now, you can't tell me that, jeez, okay, another one, here we go. Let's keep it a little bit of a mystery. Why not? The Wing Dragon of Raw Kiko Secret Rare. Well, this is um, a Pharaoh Secret Rare. I'm wondering why it didn't show as a Pharaoh Secret Rare. What the heck? I think it is, though. And it is PSA 10. Woo! Okay, this makes me really, really excited. Now, I'm curious to know why they didn't put Pharaoh Secret uh, Rare, though. Damn it, look at that. Because it's only ultra and secret, so I guess it doesn't matter, right? Hopefully it doesn't matter. Okay, another one. Here, what? Well, let's go, let's go. Uh, what could this be? Oh, okay, QCR. QCR, Silent Swordsman. Uh, you know Silent uh, Swordsman? It's kind of like old school, so that's why I, you know, set it to, uh, to be graded. It's one of those, uh, you know, a bunch of these cards, by the way, guys, I'm going to keep for myself. I might sell a couple. I don't, I don't even know, but for the most part, I'm going to keep it for myself. Here we go. PSA 10. Okay, I mean I did pull these guys fresh Dang man, let's go so far man more PSA 10s than nines Wow Okay, let's see wait wait wait. Let's keep it a little bit of a mystery another QCR Such a classic you guys know Karibo. It's such a classic and uh, it's the level 6 first edition course into secret rare PSA 10 Okay, man. You know what? My expectations were so low. I might change my mind, you guys. I might change my mind. <laughs> Dang. Okay, okay. Wait, wait. There's more. There's more. There's more. Let's keep it a mystery. Ovilus, the Tormentor. Another Kiko Secret Rare. Again, it should say Pharaoh Secret Rare. I don't know why it doesn't say that, but look at that beauty, man. The best god of all three gods, you guys. The best one. By far, actually. Not even close, if you ask me. Please. I beg. <laughs> Yes! 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 <laughs> Let's go! Man! You know what, man? I'm gonna actually get. I'm gonna have to grab, uh, grab my card more often. This experience, I never had this experience before. Wow, man. This is this is good. Now, speaking of uh, the Ferris Secrets from Keiko, uh, I didn't grade uh, a Slifer because uh, I didn't have it when I, you know, send those to be graded. I do have the card already. And you know what? Let me show it to you guys real quick. This was given to me by my guy, my good friend Rocky Salasano, man. Let me show you the uh, the condition, and if it's you know if it's really good, I'm gonna send it, man. If it's like I didn't even check the the, the condition yet, you guys, let me know what you think, man. I think I'm gonna send it regardless, you know, unless it's like obviously, you know, not a ten. And the front looks really really good, and the back. You know what, man? I'm gonna send this puppy looks really nice yeah i'm gonna send that uh so keep an eye for the next psa psa return so far look at this man how many psa 10s versus how many psa 9s i think we're getting extremely lucky so far and there's only like five more or four more we still haven't gotten to the Darmation girl which is the one that's i'm the i'm the most curious about here we go another one Let's see what it is. A little bit of a mystery. Oh, the Dark Magician, Battle of Chaos, Starlight Rare. Jeez, man, what a classic. 2022 PSA 10. Bro, PSA 10 loves me. I mean, PSA loves me, right? 
Jeez. Okay. Wow. Again, man. What a beautiful card. Starlight rare. Jeez. Three more cards, you guys. Three more cards, and I don't think I don't think I can tell which one is the uh, is the stealing the stealing steal. Oh, that makes you girl. Okay, this is the, uh, the other one. Silent Magician Zero, which again, classic card. Uh, 2024. Let's see. QCR PSA nine. The first PSA nine, man. I'm not even mad about it. Again, guys, those two, the Silent Magicians and the other one, were exactly the same. They were just equally as perfect. Why does this one get a nine? It's beyond me, you know. So two more. Wait, is Dumb Edition gonna be at the end? Wait, did they create it? I think it's the end. I can tell by the color. I can tell by the color. Okay, one more, and then we're gonna go with the Dumb Edition girl. Dark Mag. Okay, if this gets a PSA 10, -wee, it's gonna be worth a lot. It's gonna be worth a lot. I don't think so, man. I, I think I saw a little bit of. I don't, I don't remember. Anyways, 2022, Battle Chaos, Dumb Edition 25th, PSA 9. I mean, I'll take a PSA 9. I think I saw something wrong, like slightly. I, I, I don't remember. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, PSA 9. Such a classic, man. Beautiful card. So I'll take it. Last guy. Uh, last card. Last PSA. Magic or tragic. Guys, he actually graded it. This is cool. Look at it. Look. Wait, I'm going to show you two anyways. I can tell right away, but the color is a little bit like different, right? Let's see. Come on. Did they grade it? And how much? They did. Wow. Here we go. 2024 Dark Magician Girl Stainless Steel card. This is cool, man. This was perfect, guys. This was perfect. If it's not PSA 10, I don't know what to tell you, man. Here we go. Here we go. What? <laughs> no way. What? What? <laughs> oh, man. Now, this is what I call last uh, slab tragic man this was such an amazing experience guys i actually had a lot of fun especially pretty sure it's because i got so many psa 10s right i will be sending more you guys all thanks again to gonzo he's doing all the hard work and it's cheaper 14 bucks per slap it's actually kind of like a, a good deal now uh real quick if the cars are worth a lot like 150 dollars raw or more you pay more right so it goes up to like 50 to 100 dollars as lap uh, the more expensive the car is so on all these cars were 150 less we only pay 14 per slab really happy about the results you guys let me know if you uh, want to see more of these you know graded uh, uh content and i uh, hope you guys enjoy and uh yeah i'll see you in the next one